Hello everyone, this is Taria from Hidden Truth Tarot, and this is going to be for the Sun, Moon, and Rising Sign of Sagittarius. Sagittarius, this is your weekly general reading for the 30th of September through the 6th of October 2019. Now I'm using the Guardian Angel Tarot to pull a major theme and energy for you this week. I'm also using the Pictorial Key Tarot for your weekly general messages. And Sagittarius, at the end of your reading, I will be pulling several I Am positive thought cards for you as well. Beautiful. So you have Messenger of Abundance coming up here. Beautiful, powerful energy. Love it. Thank you, spirits. All right. What does Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, and Rising sign need to know this week, spirit? Thank you, spirit. Alright, Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, and Rising. Alright, Sagittarius, we are ready. Situation of the week, we have the Page of Pentacles. Crossing you is the Wheel of Fortune, beautiful. In your foundation is the Knight of Wands. Recent past energy is the Eight of Pentacles. Crowning you is the devil. Your new circumstance is the page of cups. All right, from the bottom of the deck, the overall energy is the hanged man. All right. Thank you, spirit. Let's take a look at your major energy here. We have messenger of abundance. Wonderful news regarding your career, a new job, a promotion, or acceptance into an excellent school comes into your life. You might feel ready to do something that's challenging and fulfilling. This situation may involve someone who's fun to be around and sometimes mischievous. This person, who may be you, is youthful, optimistic, and very clever. All right. So now we have the hanged man as the overall energy. So Sagittarius, what I'm getting here is that you're doing a lot of pausing and reflecting, which is very good. Uh, when you pause and reflect, you know, it, it guarantees that you're not going to overlook anything. Uh, I feel for many of you, you're gaining some type of mystical and spiritual empowerment here. There's seeing the truth of a situation or maybe a person or maybe a truth within yourself for what they really are. Some of you may be giving up bad habits as well. Uh, you know, this devil energy that's crowning you. This is what you know and this is what you're thinking about. Uh, this could be a way of thinking. You could be limiting or restricting yourself. And this is you breaking free from that energy. Some of you may be battling with addictions as well. Now we have the Page of Pentacles as the situation of the week. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. This is you being very down to earth, practical, all right, uh, being very realistic. Some of you may be starting new projects that's going to bring about some financial reward here. Uh, what this tells me is that you've, been, you've planted the seeds, you've nurtured them, and now there's been growth and expansion. I feel for some of you, you're already starting to... Uh, see some financial uh, gain manifesting. So very, very positive right here, especially with the uh, messenger of abundance. And then you have the wheel of fortune in your crossing position. And this is just amazing. Okay, this talks about taking chances, being inspired. There's a change of luck coming in here. I feel like where maybe you have been feeling limited or restricted, like I said, with this devil energy. Here comes the will of karma, the will of destiny, the will of fortune. And now you're going to break free from whatever has been limiting or restricting you. In your foundation is the Knight of Wands. This is your energy, Sagittarius, Leo, and Aries. 
Uh, this talks about taking, going after what you want, taking action, having a lot of passion and desire that is uh, really having an influence on you acting very swiftly and quickly here. Uh, there is, you know, a caution with this energy. Um, I don't feel like you guys are overlooking anything because you are taking time out to pause and reflect, but make sure that you don't get so caught up in the excitement, Sagittarius, that you may overlook something, all right, in the process. But definitely, you guys have the self-confidence that's needed, I feel like, with what it is that you're taking action on. Now you have the Eight of Pentacles coming up here in your recent past energy. Sagittarius, I mean, you guys are very diligent, disciplined, well knowledge you're at the point of mastery at what you do on a day-to-day -day basis, whether you're in school, whether you're in work, you are highly skilled at what you do. Some of you may be going back to get a higher up education, your master's degree. Some of you may be learning new skills, okay, moving up in a company. This is so positive right here. And you, just overall, you guys really put a lot of effort and time into what it is that you do. Now you have the devil. This is the energy of Capricorn coming through here. Um, with this being in the position of what you know and what you're thinking about, there's a definitely big energy here about breaking free from whatever has been limiting or restricting you. For some of you, this could be a way of thinking. There could be some, uh, there may be a need to dump some emotional baggage, okay, so you can heal and move forward. For others of you, you could be involved maybe in a toxic relationship or toxic environment. And this can also just represent a way of thinking what is a way of thinking that you have that could be holding you back and it's limiting you and restricting you. This is definitely the time to break free from this energy. And I feel like that's what this Wheel of Fortune here is. Uh, whatever you've been dealing with or going through or whatever has been holding you back. It, there's a major change coming in here for, for you this week in a positive way because it's almost like I'm getting karma. Is Your, your slate is being uh, wiped clean. There's been some debt that is taken care of and you're going to break free and uh, move past any challenges or blockages. Now you have the Page of Cups coming up here as your new circumstance. This is Cancer Scorpio Pisces. At this time, I feel you guys are very sensitive. When I say sensitive, I'm talking about that psychic energy that's flowing within you and through you. This talks about you really needing to tap into your inner well of knowledge. Really pay attention to your intuition. Listen to your dreams, signs, symbolism, synchronicities. Now, for some of you, with this pair coming up here with the devil and the page of cups, you may have some raw sexual attraction uh, that may be... Uh, you're meeting somebody for the first time this week uh, or maybe seeing somebody in a different way and it's it's that raw you know uh, energy that attraction towards them all right thank you spirit so you have messenger of abundance wonderful news regarding your career a new job a promotion or acceptance into an excellent school comes into your life you might feel ready to do something that's challenging and fulfilling. This situation may involve someone who's fun to be around and sometimes mischievous. This person, who may be you, is youthful, optimistic, and very clever. I love it. You're pausing and reflecting. You're gaining, um, you know, that spiritual enlightenment, I feel like, to really... Figure out which direction you're wanting to move or head in. And many of you are making the adjustments that need to be made at this time, especially with this coming up in your overall energy. I really feel like if you have been restricted or limited, whatever this devil energy is, you're breaking free from it. Now, with the Page of Pentacles here, some of you are starting new projects, new jobs, a new career, and it's going to be very successful for you at this time. You're being very down-to-earth and practical. This will of fortune is coming in here. Those of you that have been challenged, um, you're breaking free. Uh, I feel smoother and calmer uh, waters ahead for you, all right, times that are going to be 
I'm not wanting to say um, that you won't have any challenges. We, we all have challenges that we go through that, you know, we have to learn from, okay? Um, if we knew everything, we'd never gain any knowledge, right? So what I'm saying is, though, whatever's been hindering or blocking you, you're breaking free at this time, and it is going to allow for a big change of luck to uh, take place within your situation. And you are definitely taking action. You're moving forward uh, so, uh, with something that you have a lot of passion about and a lot of self-confidence right here, I feel, too. Make sure that you don't get so caught up you overlook anything. Many of you at the point of mastery um, with your skill. You work very hard. Uh, some of you may be hiring up your education. You may be taking classes. This devil energy, like I said, for some of you, um, this is an energy of feeling limited or restricted, bound and tied to something. You will be breaking free. Now, for a small handful of you, this is some sexual attraction, new attraction. I feel like you're going to be having feelings towards someone as well, especially with the Page of Cups here. But for the majority, this Page of Cups, really pay attention to your intuition. Listen to your own inner guidance at this time to uh, move you forward, all right? And pay attention to your dreams, signs, symbolism, and synchronicities as well. Beautiful. I am open. I am inspiring. All right. Vulnerability is my strength, not my weakness. My openness attracts those who are beneficial to my highest good. When I lean into my feelings, I am honoring my truth. When I communicate my feelings in a loving way, I am speaking my truth. I am open. I am inspiring. I am inspiring to those around me even when I don't realize it. When I am welcoming, kind, and giving towards people, it inspires them to respond to me the same way. I am inspiring. Beautiful. All right, Sagittarius, thank you guys for being so patient and waiting on me. Um, I had something come up yesterday. I love you guys. Leave me a comment. Let me know how these energies are playing out in your situation. And I send you all my love, wishes, and blessings, and I will see you next time. Bye-bye, Sagittarius.